Well, this is Todd Covington, really an example of an amazing human. The Kansas City firefighter is being hailed a hero for saving the life of a fellow fan at last night's Nats game. He spoke with us about this life-saving use of the Heimlich maneuver. Bob Barnard reports. It happened during the second inning of last night's Nats Padres game at Nats Park. A fan, roughly in his 60s, sitting by himself with a scorecard, started choking on what turned out to be a peanut shell. Fans nearby started screaming, catching the attention of Todd Covington, sitting two rows back. I'm a fairly large guy and I can use a lot of leverage, so I walked over and made sure that he was in fact choking. He, he did confirm that, and so I gave him a couple of back blows that uh, was unsuccessful, so then I just, uh, I just proceeded to perform the Heimlich on him, and uh, after, after two really good, good, uh, abdominal thrusts and the, the, the stuck peanut shell was dislodged from the airway and, and he was fine. Covington is a 50 year old Kansas city, Missouri firefighter and nurse, a battalion chief in charge of fire and EMS at the Kansas city airport. That's where we spoke to him via zoom today after he returned home from his trip to Washington. The entire ordeal lasted probably 15 seconds at most which I'm certain for him felt, felt like an eternity, but it, it was rather quick. Covington spoke to DC Sports Radio host Grant Paulson right after the incident. Paulson sharing this on social media. We just chuck another one up for the good guys, right? <laughs> he was very, very thankful. He was, and he was very polite to me. Um, he offered to buy me a couple of beers, and I told him that it wasn't necessary. Covington is no stranger to danger, and not just when he's on the job. 27 years with the Kansas City Fire Department. Last June, he was a passenger on a Chicago-bound Amtrak train that derailed in Missouri after crashing into a dump truck. Once I survived, then we kind of, uh, the other firefighter and I who were there, we kind of just went into, hey, we survived, now it's time to go to work. And, you know, again, we were just trying to help some people out. Covington was in Washington this week receiving an award from Congress for his heroic actions after last summer's train derailment. That's why he, his parents, girlfriend and son were here at the Nats game last night. It's just being a good human being at the end of the day. You know, you're just trying to, trying to be a good human being. And, you know, in the current situation, of everything going on in the country and in the world. You know, being a good human is not that hard. At Nats Park in Southeast, Bob Barnard, Fox 5 Local News.